Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do your uh, weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for commenting also. Uh, let's get into this Aries. Thank you God for blessing Aries with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Aries, let's see what the week holds for you. What does the week hold for Aries? What does the week hold for Aries? Just a week hold for Aries. All right, the cards don't want it. Okay, the week holds the nine of wands for you. All right, Aries, you're like, I am tired. I am so tired of just persevering and not giving up. This card literally says, don't give up before the miracle happens, okay? Um, it does talk about that unwavering energy of just standing there, waiting. It, it's almost over, uh, Aries. That's what the card says. You could have a secret admirer around you. Um, maybe a new boyfriend or girlfriend is coming in for you or wants to come in, wants to show up. Wow. Um, the advice is the Ace of Pentacles. There's money coming in for you. Uh, there's also opportunity, maybe a new person. It says that if this is a new person or a new opportunity, that it could very well go to sex quickly, you know, uh, with the Ace of Pentacles, go to, you know, a sexual connection relationship. You also could be making a large purchase. Money could be coming in. There's some self-actualization happening for you. Like you're saying to yourself, damn, I did this. I can actually do this, whatever it is or whatever this is for you. Um, you could see the manifestation, you know, uh, of maybe one of your hopes or dreams coming true. Um, Aries, it's just like, um, psychologically, you're really getting things, you're understanding, you're, it's, it's all making sense to you now. Um, you're at a high level, you function at a high level, uh, psychologically, like you just, things just make sense. It all falls in place. I don't know if you're, you've gone to therapy, you're in therapy, um, you're doing some healing type of energy chicken noodle soup for the soul books i don't know what you're doing but something is working for you aries the ace of pentacles also says there an opportunity will be presented to you no chase you're not gonna have to run this down it will just be presented to you and if you don't see the opportunity look again it says for some of you you're going to be getting in shape more in you know in physical shape strength training uh concern about your immunity you know, um, this looks really good. You're just trying to get grounded with the Ace of Pentacles. It says a new opportunity opportunity presents itself to you, but do know it is just the beginning. It's just an Ace. The Ace does not foretell the ending. It says you're going to have to put 110% behind this, but this is really good. What is the outcome here for Aries? What is the outcome here for Aries? What is the... Okay. The five of pentacles, clarify that with the nine of pentacles. Very nice. Okay, so the outcome here is, I don't know if you're putting money out to start something. I don't know if you are, um, if there's lack of confidence and forward movement. Maybe you go from lack of confidence to actually being very confident because money comes in for you. Uh, you transition your energy. You don't, okay, so there's a, a short story associated with the five of pentacles. It's about the Greek uh, goddess Penia. Um, she's a, the goddess of poverty. What she does is she goes around knocking on all the doors in the village. Whoever lets her in, they have a very hard time getting her out. So it, it just basically says, if you do get to an impoverished state where things are low, don't rest there. Don't, don't stay there. Don't let her stay. Get her out. Because do know that we control the energy of uh, the opportunity for money making. Uh, if you need more money, then you need more what? Work. Because that is how you make money, whatever your work is, okay? So if you need more money, you need to be looking for more work, not for a quick fix, not for, I know everybody's on this whole manifestation kick you know, it's really turning into something like the prosperity gospel that was here, especially in the States years ago. I don't know if people still follow that, but 
you, you have to do something in order to bring something in. So if you need money, then you need to be looking for opportunity. And it says it's here for you. If you don't see it, look again. Uh, create opportunity for yourself also. Okay? Because this is something you can control. And it looks like you do. You control it very well. Aries. I don't know if, wow, six of wands at the bottom of the deck. Very nice. Uh, yeah, six of wands at the bottom of the deck. It's like um, you get public recognition. Um, you're up on a platform. Um, promotion here. Maybe in your job sector. Uh, health in your business. Success in your business, if there is one. Um, high esteem for you. You walk off winning this battle of hang it in there, holding on, persevering. And now you can walk off strutting your stuff. You found balance, harmony between in something, doing something, maybe sharing your gifts, your nature. So let's see what this is about for you, Aries. One of the Kipper card, one of the fortune telling Kipper cards for Aries. False person. All right. Uh, so there's somebody false in your community. In your friend group, in your family, your family dynamic here. Um, this also with the eight here talks about other people's money. Maybe there's somebody who's not letting you in on all of the uh, the inner workings of. Someone could be holding back money from you too. Someone could have stolen money from you. Someone could be trying to steal money from you, con you, get you to give up something, to get you to come off of. It could be in your, once again, in your community, in your friend group, uh, the people you hang around, your colleagues, people you trust, maybe hired help. Maybe someone took your money or they hired you to do something and didn't pay you. Uh, but it looks like the, the exchange is happening now. They're going to, um, it's all going to come full circle and you're going to get what you, you deserve. There'll be a victory here, especially if you took it to court or litigation or some sort of mediation. It looks like you win here. Aries, this is what I have for you. If it resonates, go over to the website, book your reading there. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me here every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, where you can ask questions. Um, you can also just come for the collective reading. Aries, um, if you will, drop down in the comment section and let me know how this resonates for you. Also, um, I don't know, drop down in the comment section and um, tell me who this false person is or who's holding back money from you or money f or took money from you. All right. Thank you, Aries. Many blessings to you. Take care.